it's been a while. Um, hello, fam. Wow, this is not even at the right angle. I feel like it keeps going down. Um, welcome back to the channel. My name's Shelby. If you're new here, it's been a hot minute since I have been able to get anything up on this channel because I have a five month old. As of yesterday, I have a five month old, which is blowing my mind still to think about. I can't believe that I have a five month old. If you're wondering where she is right now, her and her dad and the pups are at grandpa's house. Um, they do that almost every Sunday. And so I am trying to get to a point where Sundays become the time where I spend a little bit of time with you guys in some capacity. Um, so I'm not gonna make this video super long, but I just wanted to come and say like, hello, welcome back to the channel and know that I still think about all the things that I'd like to be doing on YouTube and have not yet found my groove of doing that. Um, if you have kids, you know the four month mark to five month mark gets crazy with sleep and whatnot. So we've been going through a lot of that. Um, I think we're on the other side of it, fingers crossed, as far as like sleep regressions and stuff go. Um, we've moved Hallie into her own room. She sleeps in the crib, wild, um, and is doing great with that. Um, and life has been moving very fast. Um, business has been great. We're picking back up with clients, which has been super fun to be back into coaching. Um, I still had some clients right when I came back, but um, coaching has definitely taken a an uptick it's a great thing um coaching more clients and that's very exciting and the other a big exciting thing that i don't think i've actually talked about at all on here yet is that i am an official disney vacation planner now <laughs> I know, it's so exciting. So a lot of you are here either for one of two things, as me as a fitness and nutrition coach or me as a Disney loving human being. So um, I'm officially working as an affiliate of Academy Travel, um, which means that I can book Disney and Universal vacations for anyone and everyone who wants to. Um, that includes West Coast, um, East Coast, Alani, um, Adventures by Disney, kind of all the things. And technically I can do other stuff too, but I do want to have most of my focus be in Disney and Universal because that's my bread and butter. Um, that's what I know and I'm excited. I've started booking trips for friends, uh, family, friends of friends and so on. And yeah, so that's what we're currently doing. Um, I also just purchased my annual pass. And I'm so pumped. Um, if you don't know, I was an annual pass holder for like two and a half-ish years, um, back in like 2020, 2019 to 2021-ish era. Yeah. Um, the reason it got extended was be because of the Rona. Um, the parks got shut down, right? Which meant that my annual pass was not being used for multiple months. Um, and I did go like in July, I think it was July when the parks reopened and it was like not busy at all. If you guys were there during that time, you know how nice it was crowd wise. Um, and so then we extended for another year. So again, we had like two and a half ish years of annual passes and those ended um, before we decided to start trying to have kids. That was kind of like our last thing, you know, hang on to our passes till then. Once they ended, it was like, okay, We'll start trying to have kids and guess what we uh did it on the first try so <laughs> we now have hallie who's five months which is fantastic and I, I i'm loving every minute of it i feel like every day is like i'm just learning new things all the time and like the empathy that i have for parents now obviously is like tenfold because i am a parent which still sounds so crazy and weird to say um learning how to navigate fitness, nutrition, just living life with a kid. I'm a full-time work from home mom and I take care of Hallie during the day. She's not in daycare or anything like that. And I share a lot of that on Instagram that like there are highs and lows to that. Um, I don't expect it to be like perfect every day and I don't tell you guys that it's perfect every day because it's not. But yeah, it's been fun um, just navigating that. And by fun, I mean like mostly crazy, fly by the seat of your pants kind of stuff, but that's what we're doing. So, um, yeah, the other thing I decided to do was to become a travel agent. It was something I actually looked into the month before, uh, we conceived Hallie, found out we were pregnant. I had already started looking into it. And then I was like, this isn't the right time for this, <laughs> right? Like trying to figure everything out. So, um, 
I just started working as an affiliate of Academy Travel and I'm here when you're ready to book your Disney Universal what have you vacation. So that is what we have been up to lately. Um, as far as fitness goes, I am working out usually four times a week, uh, strength training with some like mixed modal cardio type stuff. Um, it is almost May, so I'm going to be adding in some additional stuff to do Murph, which I will probably do a video of that. At that point, I will be six months postpartum and I plan to do the whole thing. I will not be doing a vest this year. I don't think that's the right move fitness wise to add the vest, um, but I am planning to do all of Murph this year. I did half Murph, 13 weeks pregnant last year. Um, and it was great. I felt fantastic. It was like a good workout, but at 13 weeks, you know, my fitness was pretty normal. I just was not trying to like push too hard. Um, so I didn't want to do the whole volume because I don't work out in a CrossFit gym anymore, but I will be doing that. So I might do some filming of like what I'm doing to prep for that. If you're looking for a guide on some extra stuff you can add in, like additional training on top of whatever else you're doing to help you prep for Murph, I'm going to drop my four week Murph prep in the comments or in the description. Um, I created this for level 10. It is a freebie of ours. So you literally just click the link and it'll get sent to your inbox. Um, but this is meant to be in addition to whatever you're already doing training wise. So could you just do this and do Murph well? Probably, but you need to be doing other stuff because it's only programmed for like two days a week. And I do have it where you can do it for every single like version of Murph. So if you're going to do it vested straight through, vested not straight through, without a vest straight through, without a vest, the full thing, whatever, half Murph, uh, quarter Murph, I have options for all of those. So that if even if you've never done Murph before, you'll have a way to get involved this year. So I'm going to drop that um, there. And on the PDF, if you don't even know what Murph is, but you're like, whatever I want to see, you can get the freebie and it's got a link talking about where um, Memorial Day Murph came from, the background behind um, Lieutenant Michael Murphy, and the fundraiser behind it that happens now every year. So grab that freebie if you would like to. Um, other stuff going on. Not a whole lot. I'm just working on being, you know, back in shape, um, which has been pretty good for the most part. I've been lifting most weeks, still getting in four times a week at some point. Um, sometimes it's on the weekend, sometimes it's a little bit shorter, but we're still getting in four training sessions. I'm working on my steps being between like seven to 8,000 most days. Um, I still have some that are like five to 6,000 and that's okay. I do what I can. Um, drinking lots of water, drinking lots of element. Um, I am currently combo feeding with Hallie. So we are doing some formula and also uh, breast milk. So we're doing both. Um, so have to keep that supply up, which means we're not dieting anytime soon. Um, my goal was to get to six months. We're almost there. Um, Will I keep going after that? I don't know at this point. I'm not like dead set on like, as soon as I hit six months, I'm gonna be done. I'm just gonna kind of like see how things go. Um, because obviously it takes a lot of work and whatnot, but at the same time, right now I don't feel overwhelmed with it because we did choose to go combo feeding and we were adding in some formula. So um, that took some of that like time consumption off of me already. Um, so things are going good with that right now and we're feeling pretty good. Nutrition is really just focusing on like what I can do to make sure I'm getting in fruits and veggies every day, keeping protein up. My mom is trying to FaceTime me right now, but she doesn't know I don't have the baby. Um, we're going to let her know really quick. I always know if my mom called on FaceTime, she wants to see the baby, but I don't have the baby with me. So I had to let her know. Um, but... Honestly, I don't think I have much else to update on. I just wanted to say hello, do a quick little video and say that I'm like planning to start being more regular on here, but it will be twofold here because yes, it's going to be fitness and nutrition content, but also due to the fact that now I have a job that actually, actually involves Disney and Universal, not just me wanting to live my life as a Disney adult half the time. Um, I will likely be posting some content related to updates at Disney and Universal and whatnot um, so that you guys are in the know and can be kept up with what's going on. Um, 
I'll probably just like use whatever we get in as far as information and do like update videos. So I'm gonna actually record one today after this that's separate, that's just like updates for what's going on and everything with um, Disney and Universal in Orlando right now. So um, if you have been here for a while and you're like, oh yeah, she's back, um, I appreciate you being here. And if you're new here, you're probably like, what is going on in this video? It's just random. But at, there have been times where I have been more consistent with this and I'd like to get back to that. So that's the goal. So um, that's all I've got for today. Um, if you wanna see more content, give this video a like, hit the subscribe button, uh, drop a comment, let me know what you wanna know about Disney Universal, drop comments, let me know what you wanna know about fitness, nutrition, lifestyle, whatever. Um, it could be postpartum fitness stuff as well. I am a, a pre and postnatal fitness coach. I'm certified in that, so I can talk about that without just being like, here's my experience. Um, so yeah, um, otherwise you guys have a great day and we'll see you next time.